And good evening. I'm Paul Martino. Pittsburgh's SWAT team captured a man wanted in Florida on felony charges. It happened overnight in Brighton Heights. Chris Hoffman tells us the arrest followed an hours long standoff. A neighbor says police have been called to this house before on Lecky Avenue, but what she saw last night was to a level she's never seen before. There's been a lot of problems over there, so I don't bother them and they don't bother me. It all started around 1030 Saturday night as police made their rounds on the north side. They found a stolen vehicle outside of this house, and as officers went up to the home, they say 61-year-old Raymond Camp threatened them forced out the homeowner and barricaded himself inside. I didn't know what was going on at first until the one cop said over the bullhorn. <laughs> Police noticed camp was on the second floor with a handgun. Well, that second floor window, I can look out my kitchen window up to his second floor. Investigators found out there was an arrest warrant for camp in Florida. They called in the SWAT team and evacuated neighbors like Ruth Youngblood. And I guess that's what they were afraid of. If somebody might have been in my kitchen and he decided he wanted to start shooting. After more than two hours of trying to talk with camp, police used flashbangs and gas. It didn't work. But around 1.30 Sunday morning, camp surrendered to police. He was taken to Allegheny General Hospital before going to the Allegheny County Jail for extradition to Florida. Charges are pending for him here. Youngblood was able to get back into her home around 2 this morning. Chris Hoffman, KDKA News.